My name is Dylan Devino, and on this channel, we talk about web design, web flow, and SEO. So in this video, I'm going to be talking about how you can bulk import 301 redirects straight into Webflow. It is not a native feature. I'm sure they're going to be adding it in the coming months. It's pretty crazy that they don't have it, but there is a simple and straightforward workaround that will allow you to bulk import your 301 redirects. So here we go. So starting out here in our website dashboard, we're going to go over to the top left and click on project settings. We're going to go over to the hosting tab and scroll down to the bottom. So this is obviously where you could see your 301 redirects and there is no way to do it natively, but I do have an easy solution here. So you're going to go to the Chrome Web Store and then you're going to look up the FinSuite extension for Webflow. You're going to add it to Chrome. Now it's going to say that it's been added to Chrome. So you're going to come back over here and probably refresh the page and make sure that it is actually active. You'll scroll down and here it is, the bulk import button powered by FinSuite. So we're going to open up our Excel program right here or Google Sheets, either works. And you are going to list out all of your old URLs and all of your new URLs right in this, um, this CSV. Then you're going to download it and you are going to download it as a .csv. You're going to go over to where you could see the bulk import option and you are going to drag it right in. And I'm not actually going to upload these bogus old paths to new paths, but here you go. If you click the upload button, they will upload and you will have your bulk importing to Webflow. I hope that tutorial helped you guys out a little bit. Um, I know it definitely was annoying for me when I had to upload 300, 301 redirects one by one. Um, but yeah, when I found out about the FinSuite extension, it definitely made my day. And I hope I could uh, help you guys out, make your day a little bit. Definitely drop a like on the video if I provided any value. And uh, I post a lot of Webflow content. So follow the channel if you are interested in seeing more of that. And then I'll see you guys in the next video.